Iktomi and the Ducks. One day, Iktomi was walking by the water. He saw some ducks swimming, but the ducks did not see him. Iktomi was hungry, and he wanted to eat the ducks. He thought of a way to trick the ducks. So Iktomi pulled up some tall grass and sticks and tied them together. He put them on his back and walked past the ducks. When Iktomi walked by, one of the ducks said, Hey, Iktomi, what do you have on your back? Iktomi answered, These are good songs. I am taking them to a powwow over the hill. Iktomi began to walk away. Another duck said, Can you sing us a song? Just one song for us? Iktomi finally gave in to their request. He told the ducks, These are sacred songs. I will sing one song for you, but you must listen and obey what I tell you to do. The ducks agreed to do this. Iktomi lined up the ducks and started to sing, Close your eyes and dance. Close your eyes and dance. Whoever looks, your eyes will turn red. The ducks closed their eyes and danced while Iktomi sang. Then Iktomi picked up a big stick and hit the ducks on the head. He killed many ducks. Finally, one duck opened his eyes and saw Iktomi hitting the ducks. The young duck yelled, Hey, open your eyes. Iktomi is going to kill us all. So the last ducks flew away. Iktomi picked up all the dead ducks. He tied their feet together and carried them into the woods. He found a shady spot under the two large trees and built a fire there. He pulled all the feathers off the dead ducks and put the ducks in the fire to cook. A strong wind started to blow and two trees crashed together, making a lot of noise. Iktomi told the two noisy trees to stop fighting, but the trees kept on squeaking in the wind. Iktomi climbed up between the two trees and said, I told you not to fight because you were brothers. Just then, the wind stopped blowing and Iktomi became stuck between the two trees. Iktomi was up in the trees for a long time and he was getting hungry. The ducks were all ready to eat now. He looked around and saw a coyote. Iktomi called out, Hey, coyote, don't come here because I am cooking some ducks for myself. Coyote came to see the ducks. Iktomi told him about Coyote was very hungry and he ate all the ducks. Coyote thanked Iktomi for the good duck dinner and he walked away looking for a place to sleep. Soon the wind began to blow again and Iktomi was released from the trees. By that time, Iktomi was very hungry, but there were no more ducks to eat. He was mad at Coyote and started to look for him. After looking a long time, he found Coyote sleeping on a hill. Iktomi decided to burn up Coyote in the fire, so he picked him up and carried him on his back. When Iktomi got back to the fire, he threw Coyote in the hot ashes, but Coyote was just pretending to be asleep. When Coyote landed in the ashes, he kicked them up into Iktomi's chest and ran away. Iktomi was burned by the ashes. He quickly ran to the water and jumped in to put out the fire on his chest. Ever since then, young ducks have red eyes, and Iktomi's have had bare chest from where they were burned.